Uh oh. Always got pissed when passerby ruins your pictures? Well, with the Huawei P40 Pro, you can instantly remove them with just one click. What's up guys, it's your boy here, Joshua C. Today, I'm gonna show you one of the camera feature on the Huawei P40 Pro that allows you to snap and edit like a boss. First off, the camera features. The Huawei P40 Pro comes with the golden snap featuring the AI remove reflection, AI remove passerby and also the AI best moment. So let's head to it. Let's begin with the AI remove reflection. So I've taken out my tiny little pot and placed it behind the glass door. There will be reflections captured into the picture which makes it look unprofessional. Well, that's where the AI remove reflection comes in. Just go to edit and click remove reflection. It will analyze the picture and poof! All the reflections got removed. Isn't it cool? Next, the AI best moment. Ever wonder why do I always get to capture those wonderful candid shots for my Instagram? Well, this is why. Whenever you move, walks, or jumps, the Huawei P40 Pro's AI best moment will always capture the best moment for you to post it up onto your Instagram. Lastly, the AI remove passerby. Remember what I've shown you in the beginning? With this, you no longer need to worry about unwanted passerby ruining your OOTDs because the AI will automatically remove the extra person beside you and makes your picture stand out. Okay, since now you can snap and edit like a boss with the golden snap feature, let's show you how to move and use all your apps from your old device onto the Huawei P40 Pro. First, download the phone command app in your old device if you're not using a Huawei smartphone. Next, open up the app and scan the QR code generated on the Huawei P40 Pro with your old device. Once it's connected, just tick all and hit transfer. Now, all your apps like Facebook, Messenger, Snapchat are ready to be used in your new Huawei. P40 Pro. Besides, the Huawei App Gallery has most of the apps you are using now such as Touch and Go, TikTok, WeChat and many more. And for those apps that are not yet available in the Huawei App Gallery such as Waze, Instagram, you can still download it from its official website through the App Gallery or APK Pure and App Toy. Not to mention, you'll also be able to access to Google search engine, Gmail, and all your Google account through the web browser and to make it more convenient, you can always add it to home to create a shortcut button to your home page. As for Gmail, it's already available in the Huawei email app and all you need to do is just sign into your account and you'll be able to receive your Gmail notification as usual. So overall, you'll be able to use most of the frequent use apps in this phone even without the Google Play Store. So that's all for today. Be sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the bell icon for the latest video updates. I'm Joshua C. See you next time.